Hi Pisces, it's, oh I said Pisces, wow. This is for Sagittarius. Um, you could be dealing with the Pisces, you do have some of that energy here. All right, so hi Sagittarius, this is your reading. Uh, thank you for being here, thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated, all links are below. If you need to get in contact with me, Let's go ahead and jump into this. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing the Sagittarius with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Sag, we have somebody who who is just not in a real practical, logical, realistic state of mind, okay? This could be you. This could be your person of interest. We have somebody here who is really fanatical or they're resting in a lot of fantasy and not in real day to day what is real what is being realized something is ending okay or it has ended or is like really right at ending and somebody's trying to hold on but they want to hold on but they don't have much to hold on to or they don't have any opportunity to ask for someone to hold on with them because they don't have anything to offer or they, they don't have much to offer. Sagittarius, you could, or somebody could really be seeing the truth of the matter. And it could be that there is no going back. There has been some irrevocable change of heart, of mind for someone with the Ace of Swords here. But again, someone is trying to hold on to whatever it is that they have with this person. They could be trying to hold on to the home life. They could be trying to hold on to the money. Someone is trying to hold on to the title of, you know, I'm the girlfriend, I'm the boyfriend, whatever. But then there, the outcome is that somebody gets left out. It is, it is over. They knew it was going to be, it, it's over because somebody has already started acting independently or acting very independent from this relationship with the four and the five of pentacles someone is not involving the other someone is ignoring and neglecting the other party in this connection it may be because it's over it's gone as far as it can go um it's now about somebody making the decision to actually cut this person out or cut this relationship away. We have somebody said you or the other person trying to hold on to an energy that is just like kind of over it. We have a sad, lonely man. This is what this card talks about. The widower who is pining over a love lost, a loved one. Failing to see that he could be the reason why this is gone. We have someone who is in a mental prison here. Who feels confined, stuck, trapped, bound. Either in this relationship. They feel like someone is too clingy. They're trying to hold on too tight. Somebody feels like they need... They're going to assert their independence and they have already done so by ignoring the shit out of somebody. And it's, it's taking the other person to a place of mental instability. Not knowing what to do. Maybe because the other person or other person felt as if they were trapped in this relationship or this whatever it was. There's somebody wanting to hold on to the other person by any means necessary. Going so far to even say something like this. But the reality of the situation is this. I'm having financial issues. I can't focus on love. And I need more money. But they want this in their heart. And in their mind. And they may even go as far to say something like that to you. Because somebody's really trying to have a tie. A connection to you. Or vice versa. This is you, Sag. 
that's why the card of balance spirituality and practicality full moon in pisces is coming up this card specifically talks about that you know at worst this is the end of a dream or a dream situation ending They're, they're asking you to avoid substance abuse with this card. You need to meditate every single day. It says that some of you are in a super romantic, but not a super realistic state of being. Somebody is not focusing on the fact that something has gone full course. It's over. And somebody wants to be left alone or let free or set free. A trusted individual can come to you and give you some advice about what it is you need to do and how you need to move on or move away from. You can send out your dreams to the universe in hopes that you'll get what you want, but you also need to be realistic and practical. I'm also seeing that somebody wants to have a baby, but they are not in physically in that space where they can do that. Like something is going on with reproductive organs or there might even be an age. Someone doesn't carry the full term. Somebody is really just getting the fact that it's over, it's done, but somebody is holding on for dear life. All while the other person is out here, you know, having hot girl summer or a hot guy summer. I don't know. This is your reading, Sagittarius. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. Pay for your question and then receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link if you're feeling moved to do so. Thank you, Sag. Many blessings to you. Take care.